Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Alright, so here he is, the former UFC middleweight champion Anderson Silva. The pro record doesn't look like it did a few years ago, DC, but most people still inject the name Anderson Silva into the discussion of the greatest MMA fighters of all time. It's because Anderson is doing us a favor every time he steps foot the octagon. He could have walked away and protected the record, but the lure, the draw of fighting still is pulling at the spider. And every time he walks in there, we're getting the witness greatness. You feel it when Anderson Silva walks up the steps. I I remember staring across the octagon and going, holy cow, that's Anderson Silva. And he has that approach. He has that appeal to everyone that gets in front of him, not only in the octagon, but in life. One of the nicest guys you've ever met is Anderson Silva. And a renewed focus on recovery and physical therapy has allowed the great Anderson Silva to compete deep into his 40s, DC. You ain't going 45. There's no way. 45. You're, You're going to voice a video game. I'm going to voice a video game. <laughs> what a great idea. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at the bar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times loosely in a nutshell. Just so wise. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. <laughs> And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon. Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. advantage like this what a luxury it's a luxury i've never had one over the course of my entire career but fighting guys that are taller you struggle whenever they are very aware of such a massive advantage this guy is going to try and use this tonight oh huge head kick Place kick there by Lee. Big knee to the body. Three minutes now, round one. Oh, 
Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Big leg kick land. Trying to establish that jab once again. Back to the leg kick now, that one's no good. Right on the button. And yet another hook landed there by Silva lands flush. Oh, big punch land. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Whoa! Well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. All right, half guard position for him here, and I can hear Dominic Cruz in the back of my head just screaming about underhooks somewhere. Yeah, somehow. he loves it. I mean, but he's right, right? He's so right in terms of if you're on your back in the half guard, one thing you can't be is flat on your back, you need to be up on an elbow, right. you need to be half on the side, and you need to control the far side underhook. It is a battle for underhook when you're fighting in the half guard position on the mat. 26 total strikes have landed for Anderson the Spider Silva. Big kick land. Right hand punch to the clinch. 20 seconds left. Oh, that's a big hook to the chin. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. Horn sounds for the end of round one. Listen. Listen. Can you stay a little bit more active? All right, so a huge round for him there. Nearly had him out of there with the head kick. Did get the knockdown. Talk us through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. Strike attempt there is blocked. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive through order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Come on, bud. Let's get those hands working. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Silva gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Oh, really using his reach advantage there as he lands the punch, DC. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Oh, nice. Just misses with the right. situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by Lee. All right, so he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. So he 
Warriors really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, big left hook there. Just unable to quite find that range. How about those five minutes? All right, so the round is over. Both fighters had their moments, but you see the cut on the eyebrow, and that is not getting any better, ladies and gentlemen. That is getting worse. It continues to open up. The blood is trickling down into the eye. Certainly, if you're going to have a cut, that is not the ideal location. All right, no Telestrator for DC tonight, but we'll get you some replays. And if you like face punching, that was a good round. Yeah, where's my Telestrator, man? I want to draw this action. But yeah, John, you're right. It was the striking. It was the punches that really did allow him to take control of this round. Third round underway. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous... Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Whoa! What a fight. Oh, he landed a Superman punch. He is throwing a fast, straight hard jab. That's not a feeling jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Close guard here. He's very comfortable here working off his back, DC. Just over two minutes to go. Well, these are some excellent ground and pound strikes here, DC. There's an efficiency with which he operates in these situations. He knows exactly when to throw, exactly when to hold, and it's allowing him to really control the There's a song there, right? Know when to hold him. Know when, when to hold him. Yep, absolutely. Go. Back and forth we go here. Hands high, hands high. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds. And it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Seconds now remain in the round. Let's keep it up. That was a thudding leg kick. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands. His opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent's staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round.
beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. Well, hard to perform much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ian Levine's called a stop to this contest at seven seconds at round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Anderson, the Spider. All right, so there he is, the man of the moment, celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories of his career. And got to be nice sometimes with all the hard work that you guys put in when it goes down exactly the way you drew it up. A lot of people talk about doing certain things. It's harder to deliver on those promises you make. Thank you for watching. Please wait for more videos. See you soon.